and welcome to Pulse TV's first ever show, unless you saw the stuff in Matt Davis putting his face to a camera and doing some funny faces and going there and stuff like that. Anyway, this is a much more better version of Pulse TV because there are now two presenters, not just one pitiful presenter. Right, and with further ado, let me introduce you to my own presenter. Some say that he is an idiot, and others say that he's not. But anyway, please welcome Ashley Dunn. Hello, it's me. Yes. And he's still adjusting his microphone. That's how I'm prepared. <laughs> oh dear. Right. Hey, hey, um, we oh, are wait. here for one purpose only, and that is to recall something that both me and him felt very strongly about at the time. A big disaster. In the summer of 2007, some devastating floods shocked this the Sun Valley Railway, and we are here to recall what happened. Welcome to SVR, Rise and Fall. The floods did amazing damage. They destroyed embankments, washed away bits of track, and even pulled on signals. The cost was originally estimated £500,000, but it went up and up and eventually reached £3 million. Yeah, most of that came in insurance money, luckily, but still, the public was extremely generous. And just to show how much damage the railway received, we put together this little slideshow of the damage done. from those pictures some devastating damage but luckily part of the line from Kinnam Institute of Beauty remained open and we are about to have a ride you see where it's on the tube please mind the gap between the train and the platform oh, yeah. right. at first this was the only section of line open from Beauty to Kidderminster, but this Saturday good news the railway has reopened from Bridge North to Hampton Road after repairing a few bridge damages caused by lorry drivers. It's true, people did ram into the lorries with their... Uh, they drove into the bridge the with their lorries? Yes, yeah, sorry. That yes, and then they just drove off inconsiderately. Yeah. No consideration for railways. I'm sorry about this, Jamie. I don't know if you ever watched this. Being jumped through. Oh. Yeah, and drinking coffee. Nothing means coffee. Station for us, and we're sorry about the fact we can't film a bit more of you, but that's because his camera keeps dying. Literally, the batteries yes. just keep dying. How many have we gone through today? Two uh, sets? We've gone through a set of pain with a space set and another set. So. We've filmed five minutes. Anyway, welcome okay. to Beauty, the current terminus of this part of the route. Yes. This, well, you know, it's just a disaster as far as we're concerned. That and, um, the public has been very generous. The yes. railway thought it would be, you know, seriously in trouble. But yeah, and then we had the help from other railways. The North Yorkshire Moors did yeah. a a guard which raised about well, a, thousands a, of hundreds of thousands of pounds, yeah. I think. It's amazing what people can do, even though yeah. they are, you know, sort of fighting each other to get more money, more people, more passenger journeys, yeah. better publicity. It's, it's amazing how they pull together in the end. Yep. Oh, okay. <laughs> 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 
Yeah. Yeah. 